Hello everyone. So here today we will see what does national education policy actually mean for the India's youth. So the Indian national education policy is a comprehensive framework that outlines the vision and direction for the development of education in the country. It was approved by the government of India in July 2020 and it aims to bring significant reforms to the education system in India and has several implications for the country's youth. So let us see some of the key points. The first point is holistic development. So the NEP emphasizes the holistic development of the students, focusing on the cognitive, social, emotional and physical aspects. It encourages a multidisciplinary approach for learning, promoting critical thinking, creativity and also problem solving skills. Flexibility and choice. So earlier Indian education system was very rigid but this policy provides flexibility and choice to the students allowing them to choose their preferred subjects across disciplines. So it encourages multidisciplinary approach. So one student can learn two or three different things at the same time, depending upon his or her interest. Then skill development. So this policy emphasizes the development of essential skills such as communication, critical thinking and vocational skills, which will help them practically to gain skills or orient them skillfully to enhance their employability. Then vocational education, so that is what we were talking about, that the apart from the mainstream education, uh, this particular uh, policy will help the students develop their job ready skills and entrepreneurship abilities as well. So the redu it will definitely reduce the gap between the education and employability. Inclusive education, which focuses ensuring equal opportunities and accessibility of students across uh, different backgrounds along with their disabilities so that it will bridge the gap between the gender and other differences which are there. So promotion of social inclusivity is there. So that is the reason why students who are coming from vernacular languages there the NEP is playing a very important role by promoting the teaching in the local languages. Finally, the teacher training and professional development. So NEP emphasizes that the teachers should be first trained so that it, they will be enabled uh, uh, to give the professional development opportunities. Okay, and innovative teaching methodologies could be adopted. So uh, we really think that this NEP uh, policy, uh, this new policy will be very, very useful for the uh, coming uh, for the India's youth and it will transform the entire education system, making it more inclusive, student centric and skill oriented. Thank you so much.